Kate Garraway was emotional as she gave a live interview on Good Morning Britain today. The presenter appeared on the ITV breakfast show this morning where she discussed the last few weeks having lost her husband Derek Draper. Derek had been suffering from long-term complications after he contracted coronavirus back in 2020. He had slowly been recovering but tragically suffered a heart attack at the end of last year and passed away last month. Kate took an extended leave of absence from her hosting duties on Good Morning Britain whilst Derek was ill and when he passed so she could be with her children Darcy and Billy, but she returned to the show today for an interview about her loss. Kate discussed Derek's final moments and a touching message Darcy said to her dad before he passed away. Kate revealed Derek had seemed the furthest from death before he died, after progressing with Derek in a positive place. Speaking on the show this morning, she appeared in good spirits while clearly emotional. She told the hosts, it feels like my emotions are at 110%. She added the messages from pals and viewers, made her weep, and she was grateful for the support from fans and from her ITV family. Kate told Susanna Reed and Richard Madeley, Derek had never been in a more positive place than he was before the cardiac arrest that led to these events. It was the furthest from the spectrum of death we've ever been. Then it was one of those stop-the-clock moments. We were then told we had 24 hours, but it turned out that he held on for a month. Kate revealed in Derek's final moments, she and her children had told him not to worry about them, with Darcy telling him, We'll be okay. Darcy told her father, Dad if you can't do this we'll be okay, release yourself. Kate revealed that at the end, Derek couldn't open his eyes or speak. Alone in the room when her husband passed away, she detailed the moment she had to break the news to their children he was gone with son Billy taking her back with his response. He told her, I'm so sorry mum, with her telling her co-hosts that her reaction was, oh my god, they really have taken on board a caring role. After Richard asked Kate how she managed to keep it all together all the way through Derek's sickness, the mum of two explained, I'm not sure I did it very well. I think I relied on everyone else. I think I have a massive debt to a lot of people, especially Derek. The children have also been extraordinary throughout it all. It feels like five years and also five minutes since I was in the studio. Kate revealed her daughter Darcy's role as a pallbearer at the funeral service was her own decision, saying, She insisted on doing it and I thought it was a beautiful thing. On her children's grief, she went on, For their grieving, we are in the foothills, we know there is a long way to go. They didn't want to pressure him to keep going. I don't think he did feel that, I think he kept going because he wanted to be here. Kate is now set to return to the show later this week, confirming she would host on Thursday following her extended absence. She shared, a new life starts now. I don't quite know how it's going to be, but grief isn't containable is it? Some people say, why, are, you going back to work? Well, everybody does have to, don't they? Life has to start any minute now. Noticing that her son Bill was late for school, Kate added, in fact he's late actually. Bill's going to have to go to school, in fact, somebody better tell him to hurry up, or I'll be in trouble with the teachers. On her return, she joked she was excited for a blow dry, as she gets back to studio life. She said, I'm going to be looking forward to a blow dry, don't worry, I am going to be looking a lot more respectable. She went on, I am looking forward to coming into the world and connecting with everyone again. Thank you for having me back, but have a little patience, I might be a bit rusty.